Alright guys, I have a short and quick video of something I just experienced. Um, here you can see I have a, uh, what is this, a taco, SR502, and I had an issue with it not working. So I had to do a lot of troubleshooting, trying to figure out what was the issue. Um, Check the water pressure. The water pressure was low. It wasn't working. Um, let me open this back up. Water pressure was bad, so I had to go in here. And as you can see, it's fine now. It's actually going up a little bit as it gets hot. But um. I'm gonna have to double check that. I might have put too much water. But, uh, yeah. We're having a problem with the burner. It's a burning Burnham Series 2 uh, burner. And what I found out after some assistance was that uh, with the flute here, looks like I may have gotten you know a backdraft situation and I had to use this to restart the burner no matter what I did it wouldn't work so a lot of people out there may have issues just in between here there's a little switch that you press to reset right there and that actually helps start the burner it took me um, some time to kind of go through the steps make sure everything was working uh, one and out, and again I had to do the water situation, making sure that that was fine. I um, opened up in here the taco, the valve, and a lot of times you may have to short out these two wires together. Um, you know, one and two together to kind of trip the thermometer to kind of short out the thermometer so you have to short out these two here um, one and two red and white wire you have to short them out together connecting them and then another red and white depending on how many zones you have as well so these are different options that you can use to restart your boiler before you have to call a professional um, like subscribe let me know if that helps you or anyone out there with an issue with their boiler. Um, hopefully it helps because um, you don't want to be without heat or hot water with the family in the house on a cold winter's night. Thank you.